Hello everybody. Um, I'm gonna make this short so we can get right into the video. Um, I know I haven't posted in a week and the reason for that is because I've been very busy with stuff outside of like editing and stuff so I've been focusing more on that right now. And uh, the other part of it is whenever I set a date I get too overconfident in my ability to get the video out on that date to where I believe I have enough time to just kind of take a break and then I don't end up editing the video and then getting behind schedule. So from now on, not going to be setting any more dates. The videos will come out when they come out. Uh, not sure about a schedule, but they will come out w within maximum a week or, you know, seven days from each other. So just wanted to get this out of the way because, you know, I haven't posted in a week. So and all the parts are recorded, so they're ready to be edited and they will come out and we will start the Elden Ring Ascended mod after I'm done with that. So. Thank you for your patience, thank you for your support, on to the video. What's up everybody, welcome back to the channel, or welcome to the channel if you're new here. We're back on Dark Souls, and if you missed part 5, then to quickly recap, I explored through the rest of Onor Londo, and fought Ornstein and Smo for basically the entire video, and then lost a lot, and then in like the three-fourths part of the video, that's where I cut and then went and looked around for like three, four hours searching for the Titanite pieces to level up my weapon. And at the end, I also got the Titanite slab from the Stray Demon. So now my weapon is level 15. I also killed the Firekeeper Murderer. So yeah, that was, it was a very eventful part. We also met up with this guy. In this part, got a couple of goals. I actually have the boss list off to the right on my OBS. And looking at it, we have a few bosses to go and kill. Alright, so the first of many bosses I need to kill, Great Grey Wolf Sith. Which uh, brings me to something I said in a previous part. Remember when I said the Crest of Artorias is probably for the DLC? And uh, also, I ended up just chancing upon finding the crest of Artorias. It cost me 20,000 souls, but uh, I'm pretty sure that's how you access the DLC. Unless I'm just completely wrong and, you know, there's just a crest of Artorias that doesn't lead to the DLC. It just kind of has his name, which would elude to the DLC, which would completely take me off track, but you know what? It would make sense. Yeah, well, I'm wrong. Turns out, the Crest of Artorias is actually for this. And also to get to the boss. Is that a mushroom? What is this thing? That's a really big sword. Oh, there's a lot of swords. How many people have tried to take down this wolf? That's a big dog. Eh, nice knife trick. Hey, I recognize that music. Wait a minute, so that's where this is from? Ooh. Oh. I, I kind of feel a little bad killing a, a wolf. Closest thing to a dog, so I mean, I feel, I feel kind of bad. Also, apparently there's lore that makes us even more sad, so, mm. Hey, if you kill me, I ain't gonna feel bad though. Sorry, pup. It had to be done. Covenant of Artorius. Soul of Sif, Humanity, and Homeward Bone. Wow, I actually do feel kind of bad. Wait a minute. <laughs> but looking at this boss list, we are almost done with this game. Because from the looks of it, all we really have left, as far as like crazy main bosses, is Gravelord Nido, Seath, 
I don't... I th actually, I think we do have to kill the four kings. And then, uh... I'm not sure if Gwendolyn counts. But then we have also the Bed of Chaos. Also not sure if that counts. And then Gwyn. So I learned that this painting apparently does something. Huh. Yeah, I, I mean... I knew the painting looked awesome, but I didn't know I could actually use it. I didn't know we were on that. <laughs> I didn't know this was Mario 64. That would suck. Oh, okay, just throw me right into it. Painted world of uh, Ari Ariamus. Mm -hmm. hey, that's how you say it. <laughs> just based off what I'm seeing though, this might just be my favorite like place. I dig snow areas, man. Although, why does this just look like a snowy version of the asylum? So far, that's what it looks like. I gotta see everything. Somehow missed this. Shank. What are those? I'm assuming they explode on death. I was wrong, they don't. They just throw fireballs at you. Oh, yeah, I've, okay, cool. Honestly, I don't know what I can and can't dress anymore. No, ah, uh, whatever. It's probably not even that helpful of an item anyways. Whoa, 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 hey, hey, hey. Bird person? Find him, whoa. Ow, is that a phalanx? And this toxic really ain't running up, huh? Oh, now it's covering the whole thing. And it just fell apart. And you're dead. Stop. Ah! What are these? Just hit the contraption. Oh, okay, so that does actually do something. That statue was there for a reason. Ooh, oh, that's a boss door. Okay. Okay. First, heal. Second, if it doesn't start immediately, yep. Crossbreed Priscilla. Ah, you know, it wouldn't hurt to hit ya. Oh no. Don't tell me it's one of those fights where they're gonna disappear, reappear, and slash at you. Oh! Invisibility. Okay. Well, you made that real easy for me. You know what I love about human enemies? They can never hit behind them. If you just stay behind them, it's game over. As shown here. And you're dead. Sorry. I seeketh to kill all bosses, so uh, you just... Yeah, you just happen to be in the way, so... Sorry. Man, depending on how many bosses we kill in this part, this series might end a little bit sooner than I thought. Okay. So somewhere over here, we're supposed to be able to get to the catacombs. Oh wow, it got dark really fast. Give me a lantern. Oop, lever. You patches. Yeah, I know not to trust you. Honestly, I feel like I should just kill him right now. I swear, if patches kills me, man, I'm not gonna be very happy. wouldn't pull the lever on me, would he? You suck! I knew it. I knew he'd do it. That trading. He's dying now. See, ladies and gentlemen, this is why you do not trust a man named Patches. He will betray you. Oh, yeah, you're standing a little far back now, huh? Oh, yeah, it definitely did. Why did you tell me 
<laughs> oh, humanity. Yeah, sorry, buddy. No! Don't... Ooh, I'm gonna kill you in the next game, too. Oh, he parried me. Can't I sit in one of these? Die. There it is. There we go. I knew it. Where do we end up because of this? In a very dark space, all right. Mm-hmm. Oh, shoot. Sarcophagus Grave Lord. Enter Covenant? Eh, sure, why not? Grave Lord Sword and Miracle Grave Lord Sword Dance. Okay. So. Oh, shoot! I can't catch a break! Man, it is really a journey to find this guy named Pinwheel, huh? This can be one of two bosses. Oh, no. Never mind, this is Pinwheel. Got this ominous music. I mean, all right. Come on, I know you're obviously the real one. Oh, okay, he's a pushover boss. Got it. And then just hit him one more time. All right. Well, that was, um, okay. By the right of kindling, you may now kindle beyond the normal limit. Okay, so now we can get 15 flasks. And what is this? Mask of the Child. All right. Is that the demon ruins? <gasps> oh, no, 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 no. I didn't mean to do that. What, really? Wow, that is stupid. Well, there goes 40,000 souls. Sk oh, finally. Oh, it's not one of those types of items. Okay, well, that's cool. Replenishment. Pretty dang certain they can't come down here. Are you kidding me? This is it. This is it right here. Oh wow, that water actually looks nice. Oh boy, okay, here we go. Neato. We have to drop into the abyss to fight this guy. 
This is this is probably gonna hurt a lot. Oh god, that's a lot of damage. So that is Nito. Okay, good to know. I'm fighting that type of enemy. I can I hit him? Okay, I can, but he um yeah, he doesn't take damage. Okay, so that just kills everything in sight. Now take this damage. I ain't dying to you or your kin. Come on, do your soup up. There we go. Kill everything in sight so I can get an easy kill on everything else. Sweet. All right. Ah! What even is Nito? Is he like the Grim Reaper or something? Oh my god, I'm stuck. That's it. I'm dead. Go Woo! Ah, shit. Nuke again. Wow, okay, yeah. So this fight is extremely easy if you just bait the nuke. Okay, well, not this close. And that's Grave Lord Nito. The rage was literally not even worth it. I raged for no re- Lord Soul. Yo? Humanity. And how many souls for that? 60k. I'll take it. There it is. Ah. Alright. Whoa. This is the tomb of the great Lord Gwyn. Tarnished it shall not be by the feet of men. If thou art a true disciple of the dark sun, cast aside thine eye. Hear the voice of mine self, Gwyndolin, and kneel before me. No. Who do you think I am? Betty, yeah, who do you think you are? Why trespasseth upon the great lord's tomb whilst thou art a disciple of the dark sun? Mark the words of myself, Gwyndolin. Thou shalt not go unto Okay, sure. Come here! Now don't you dare peace out on me. That was your first mistake. Ha! <laughs> there we go. Swathed in death. An eternal curse upon thee. Soul of Gwendolyn. Watch him troll me. Nope. Miracle Sunlight Blade. Alright, so after looking at my list, we only have six bosses left, and I think I'll either do the finale in the next part, or I'll kill three bosses in the next part, or maybe four, and then part eight will be the finale, so to be continued. Ah, shh. Mm. 